what is up you guys? It's me, Love Kara, and today we finally got our blow up pool. I've been waiting for this pool all summer long. Quarantine, I've been jealous getting FOMO of people that have pools. I wanted a pool, so what did I do? I bought myself a pool. Oh, it does come with some type of... Oh, an air pool. I don't know what this is gonna do. So I think I'm supposed to put a plug in there or on this side, but I'm not really sure if I did that right, but this is what it looks like in the beginning. Okay, all the plants are basically I'd dead. Bring the hose towards the middle. I mean, it's looking good. We need to get a pool pump. We need to get a little, whatever those strainer things are. So we filled up the pool. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. I've wanted a pool for my entire life. Actually, I still want a pool. This is not like, you know, a real pool, but it's the best with what we can do right now. We have the hose in it. It's almost fully full, full filled. Um, we ordered this little poop thing that has two different faces. This is me most of the time, but sometimes when I'm in my pool I look like that. And this, you can put chlorine like tablets in it, so we're gonna go get that because it just came today. We also ordered this pump on Amazon as well. They didn't have any Intex ones, so it's just kind of a random brand from China. But I think it's working so for, for now. For now it's working. I don't have a skimmer yet like for the water to clear, clean out like the leaves and debris and dead animals. But that won't happen because I cover it at night. Hopefully I don't think it will happen. So for now we are literally using a kitchen strainer. But it does work. It's not effective for like the whole pool because it's pretty small but for now like the top just some, some some leaves and stuff it's been working I also ordered these pool testing strips is that what it's called a smart test pool and spa test strips which tests like the pH level the alkalinity level other levels as well um, to see if anything funky is growing in there this is me and my floaty that I also got um, I got it a few years ago actually it was in my basement and I was like oh my god I could finally use it I feel like a professional pool person I had to watch so many pool videos because I didn't want it to get algae and disgusting because that's happened to me before one time on a, with a smaller Costco pool. I also got these Clorox pool tablets, the chlorine ones. I'm not sure if they work as good as the other brand. It's like a popular pool brand. But you know what? We're balling on a budget here, so we had to get these. But I think they're going to work fine. Um, we're going to put them in a little poopy floaty thingy and see what happens. Sit, ready. Ready. Sit, sit. Yay, good boy. Good boy. Pool update. I've had my pool for like four weeks now. As you can see, it's getting a little dirty. There's some leaves in it. My floaty is a little deflated, but I did get, as I showed you before, I got this chlorine thing where you could put chlorine in it. So obviously it's not green. The chlorine's doing a pretty good job. I also got this vacuum over there. You can see, let me just grab it actually. Watch the camera just fall. Oh, my sleeve's gonna get wet. This is the pool vacuum that I got on Amazon. I'll link it in the description below. It's actually, it was like only 30 or 25 or 35, I don't really remember, um, dollars. And it does a great job of vacuuming. I thought, I was so stupid, I thought it was like an electrical one. And I was confused when I, when there are no wires. What you do is you, pl you plug, you screw your hose in right there. And the pressure, oh, the bag's not on it right now, but there's a bag that goes on the, that little green circle. Um, and the pressure of the water, I guess, pushes... I don't actually know what the hell it does. It's It makes a suction thing, okay? It's called tech. Er, no, it's not. It's called engineering. It's called... Yeah, engineering. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed my pool. It's not gotten really gross or grimy. As long as you take care of it, it should be great. I know I never fully made a montage of Be My Pool, which is something I regret. But... Today is probably going to be the last day that I will use it, potentially. 
um, because it's nearly October. It's pretty cold here in New York. I don't want to face that I have my pool away because I've only used it a few times because it came pretty late in the summer. If you're thinking about getting an inflatable pool to get one now and in the winter time, if you're ordering it from Amazon because it's definitely going to be a lot cheaper than when I bought it. Is that cold? <laughs> 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 okay, but you These are the skimmers that I got. I got a two-pack set on Amazon in case I need a flat one. I don't know why. And then this one is good for just like going deep and going jellyfishing. Jimmy is SpongeBob like. <laughs> Would you look at that? I'm just like not confident enough to be up in a bikini on YouTube yet because like I didn't glow up this quarantine like I'm working on it but like I did it ow I will link everything that I talked about in the description below if you want to get it thank you so much for watching this video subscribe for videos every single week here on love k-ray